best for soil, anaerobic soil disinfestation, advantages and disadvantages. I will give you information about the advantages but also the disadvantages of the anaerobic soil disinfestation method, in short, just called ASD. What is ASD? The term ASD means anaerobic soil disinfestation. It is a method that creates temporary limited anaerobic conditions in the topsoil layer. Most pathogens and nematodes are not able to survive such conditions and therefore perish. ASD is the application of one ton fresh plant material, grass or green manure, per hectare per centimeter depth of soil. Often 40 tons per hectare is incorporated in 40 centimeters depth of soil. The soil should be wet or be wetted. The surface is tarped with VIF. Depending on the target organisms, it should be there at least six weeks. ASD is very effective in controlling many nematode species. For example, root lesion nematodes, potato cyst nematodes, the root knot nematodes, Meloidegyna chitwoodi, phallax and incognita, and even the stem nematode, Ditilenchus dipsaki, decline strongly. The fungi Rhizoctonia solani, AG3, Veticillium dahlia, and Sclerotinia sclerotiorum do not survive a well-performed ASD. ASD is implemented successfully in strawberry growing controlling Verticillium dahlia and asparagus controlling Fusarium oxysporum FSP asparagi. As only organic material in water is incorporated in the soil, no undesired chemical substances will remain in the soil after the disinfestation process. The soil is not sterilized like it is after steaming. Many beneficial organisms will survive ASD and will recover within days, and some of them even in hours after removing the VIF. Some species do not suffer from ASD. Examples are the trichodorids, also called free-living nematodes, who transmit tobacco rattle virus. Rhizoctonia AG2, the one in carrots and sugar beet, is not controlled. And the problems with pythium can be worse after ASD. So before using ASD, you have to know which pests or diseases are in the field and check whether ASD is effective. ASD is not effective at soil temperature below 15 degrees Celsius. This means for northern countries, that the method has to be applied during summer season. To implement ASD, you have to choose a main crop that is harvested early. Lettuce, peas, winter barley are some examples. Virtually impermeable film, VIF, needs to be checked on damages. Holes should be repaired as soon as possible because of oxygen returning to the soil, which prevents an effective control. The VIF can be used just once and cannot be recycled. This makes the method expensive. Alternatives, like a sprayable coating or other plastics that can be recycled, are in research. For the moment, this method is feasible for high-value crops like asparagus, strawberries, or for the treatment of first introductions on small areas. Also, useful soil organisms that need regular supply of oxygen such as earthworms, will not survive the ASD process.